What's going on, YouTube? Um, this is going to be the review of the Image Armor R Series replacement ink for the RI One Thousand. I did a little, uh, I did a little short video um, before, but I'm gonna show you. What comes in the pack. So this is chip two. So. What they're doing to save us some money is just giving us the bag and the chip. Let me open this up real quick. Right, two. Inside the original RI. 1000 cartridge, you'll find the same thing. Find a bag. You're going to want to shake this the same way that they instruct you here. So you're going to agitate this for a little bit. And basically, you're going to take out this, replace this, take out the chip, and put in this chip. I'm trying to see if I could do that on camera. These original bags are glued in. So just be careful to pull them out and you're going to put them back in the same way. So let's agitate this. This actually feels like, I've never opened up a full cartridge, but this looks like it has more ink, but that is unverified. So let's shake this up for a little bit. If you don't want to see this, you can just skip ahead. But I'm going to be doing this for white 2 and white 1. And then we're going to do a print test. So shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your booty. Shake your booty. Alright, so basically you're just going to line up. This is the old one. This is the new one. There are some slight differences this is this aluminum piece is a little bit longer this is shorter but it should work I'm gonna line that up you're gonna take out the chip the chip is orientated in a specific way so let's open up this pack, match the orientation, and swap it out. And it's orientated like this. Yes. So there are there's a plastic tab here. I'm just gonna move it that way. Pull it back a little bit. Take this one out. Pull it back. Put the new one in. Just like that. Make sure everything is nice and secure. The edges are clear. Close them down. Two screws. Where's the other one? And that's basically it. The chip is meant to be a little loose. The contact points in the printer um, include with that. So you're good. I'm going to turn you back on for part two in a second. Alrighty, so I've just um, taken out the cleaning cartridges and, uh, excuse me. And now, inserted the white ink so it detects it. It says I have a 990 error, so let me power off and then power back on. 
Alrighty, so I just did a restart of the printer, and as you can see, it's detecting the two cartridges that we replaced. <clears throat> All we have to do now is switch it into white mode. Reset the erase And it will now start to charge the lines and clear the cleaning solution from the lines and put white ink inside of them. Kind of hard to see because the glass is a little tinted, but yeah. I'll turn you guys back on once that's done and we do a test print. Mm, that looks amazing. I'm actually going to print another one of the previous artworks and I'll put them side by side so you guys can check it out.